Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new here. I got so lucky at their mess recently. I feel like this past six months have been so good with their mess. I was just so lucky every time I walked in there. Well, not every every time, but every other time, you know, was a success and I couldn't be happier. So I would say even if you don't get something you want right away the first time you go, just keep going. Go there two, three times and they will for sure offer you something and one uh, tip that I can give you, it's like the best <laughs> tip ever, go there in the morning when nobody's still there, when they have fresh deliveries, go in the morning and I 100% guarantee you that they're gonna have something available for you, waiting for you. Uh, it's, you know, just like... It did in this case, so I randomly went there one morning. Um, I was like, okay, tomorrow at 10 a.m. I'm gonna go to her mess, I'm gonna see if they have anything. These are the two pieces that I asked for and they delivered, you see? So it actually works, but if you go in the morning, if you go in the afternoon, everything will be pretty much sold out. This is what I've experienced so far and I'm just sharing, you know, because why not? I want you guys to um, get whatever you want as well from Hermes and I want, you, I want you to kind of believe in the brand that it's not just about building up a huge history in the store, but it's about good relationships for sure. You have to find a nice essay, you have to be polite with them and nice to them, but you know, it's just the common rule. It's what you have to do everywhere with everybody else, even at the grocery store, when you go there, you have to be nice to a cashier lady because she's still a person. Yes, she doesn't work at Hermes, but it doesn't make her any different from the Hermes essay, for example. So just be nice in general with everybody. Uh, but this is what everyone is saying, that you have to be nice to an essay, but you know, you just have to be nice with everyone. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say here. Let's start with this one, because I've been just talking for so long. This was an online order actually and I love ordering online from Hermes because sometimes you can really score amazing things there if you're quick enough. So just, you know, set up your Apple Pay whenever you see something, just double click and uh, it's yours. This is what happened with this piece, but it's actually for my mom. This is something she really wanted and I already filmed an unboxing on this thing quite a long time ago. I would say it was in summer, uh, but I never uploaded it because I was sitting with Adele and I filmed with her and she was kind of like, you know, naked without a top and she was all over this bed. She was here and there and you could hear her talk. So honestly, I didn't feel comfortable posting it. Yes, I did cover her up. So like I blurred her out so you couldn't see her. Uh, but at the same time, I don't know, it just didn't look good enough for me to post, so I never did. So I have decided to include this in this video because I never got to share the other piece with you, which is, I know, ridiculous, but that's how I am. It's a cute little thing that's almost never available. Ta-da! They gave such a huge box for this like this. When I saw it, I was like, oh my god, are you guys kidding me? So here it is. It's the mini uh, Brida Brock, a little cosmetics pouch, which is so cute. I love this color. And if you follow me on Instagram, you guys know that I have the exact same piece um, in the exact same color. So we have the blue, we have the green. I love this color combination. It is so perfect. And this little kitty is just so adorable to wear in summer. Um, I'm not, you know, I never wore it in the city, but I did wear in like, you know, Italy. So we went to Rome and I wore it there once because I was on holiday, I didn't care much. Uh, but generally speaking, this is a cosmetics pouch. This is what you use it for. I actually see a lot of bougie ladies use it in Dubai to go to the beach, you know, that kind of vibe, uh, which is so cool. Uh, or uh, Monaco, you know, when you go to, I don't even know, Riviera Hotel or Four Seasons Hotel at Cap Ferrat and you just stay there at the beach and you have your little uh, Brida Brock, uh, carry all little thing with your essentials, with your body oil. It just looks so bougie. I love it. So um, this is just such a cute little cosmetics pouch, but 
actually have never seen a person use it as a cosmetics pouch i see people use it as little purses um this is why my mom wanted it so whenever we go on vacation like a beach vacation um she just for breakfast for example uh, she loves to bring uh, like a little mini bag with her to, you know, put her lipstick, sunglasses, you know, that kind of things uh, to breakfast or for a walk or something. And she doesn't have a lot of these tiny little bags that she can just use at the beach. So when she saw mine, she really wanted one. And here we go. So I saw one. I actually offered my mom mine because... I just don't see myself using it that much. I didn't use it that much in the first place. I think only twice uh, since I got it, which is not a lot in my opinion. And mine was kind of an impulse purchase, not planned at all. So I said, you can, you can have mine. It is absolutely new. Like, I'll just gift it to you. And she agreed. But then we saw the new one. And she said, just order because there is also my sister there. And she might want one. So both of them. Both of these Brida Brags will go to my mom and then uh, one will be my sister's and then the other one will be my mom's. But this is what it looks like. It has this, you see like this attachment on the handle so you can open it for your convenience to easily access the inside of the pouch. Here what it looks like inside. This is, I swear, honestly, just like the fabric you have on the dust bags of Hermes bags. And we have one big compartment over here and then two smaller ones on the other side, which is super duper convenient. Um, it has a little tag over there, not interesting. But yes, this is the entire little thing. It's so cute. I love it so much. I don't know why I don't use mine. I wish I did use it more and... Uh, this way I could keep it, but at the same time, I'm like, but I really just don't use it all that much. So what's the point of keeping it? If my mom really wants it, she can have it, you know? Um, so yeah, and now we have two more. These were actually the um, store scores. So I went there, it was Tuesday morning. I came at around 10.30, no, 11. I came there at 11, but it was still early enough because everybody was pretty much available. Uh, not everyone, but uh, one essay, she was such a lovely lady. Um, she actually offered me the mini Avalyn once, um, last winter, I believe. And, uh, yeah, it was her again, and she remembered me, and she was really nice, and uh, just, you know, we had a nice conversation about our mess, about what I like, what I want to add to my collection, about my wish list, and all of that stuff, and then I asked about these two pieces. Well, I actually asked about one piece at first, but then she mentioned this one. I was also looking for it, but I like, you know, I was 100% sure it's not available and then she just brought it out and I'm like, really? Okay, seriously? Like, yeah, sure, I'm gonna take it because <laughs> it's so cool. Let's start with this one. This is the, the item I actually went there for. We've got the receipt. Just keep it in the back. Here is the cute little box. I love their boxes and their ribbons. We have the dust bag. Ta-da! So this is such a cute little thing and I wanted this piece for since last year. Not gonna lie, since last year. And this is the Constance Slim Wallet or Compact Wallet, however you wanna call it. Is it in focus? It's in gold hardware and this blue color is called uh, navy blue or bleu marine. It's a very beautiful color. It's not this super bright electric blue color that's a little bit trickier to style. Yes, it looks bright and fun, but in reality, I, I personally don't really know how to style that type of color. But this is a more darker, deep, navy blue color which is so beautiful with gold hardware um little cloth inside this is what it looks like it has this 
a mini like a coin purse inside that you can remove and use separately or use together it is very kind of small and slim so i'll put it back but otherwise it has one slot over here inside and that's it oh and another slot on this side and what's cool about this little piece is that it has this uh loop at the back and you can attach a belt and wear it as a little belt bag so i have the kelly pocket belt it already comes with a tiny little pocket um like a mini pochette where you can store a little bit of the coins maybe cash maybe a few cards but it's very slim it's very tiny honestly not a huge huge fan of it i do wear it occasionally but not all the time usually i just prefer to wear the kelly belt separately just like a belt um but i really wanted a piece like this to add to the belt and wear it together on top of maybe a coat or on my jeans or on top of a dress or something like that i think it just looks so very cute also on Etsy, you can order a little strap in the exact same color, so it will be exactly the same like it was from Hermes. Unfortunately, Hermes don't offer this kind of things, but then it's like a little insert like this one, and then it has two D rings, or no, not the D rings, it has two little holes, and then you can attach the strap. Uh, to these holes and wear uh, this little thing crossbody as a micro bag which is so cute and adorable as well i already found the strap in uh in this color but the only problem is that it's a hundred swiss francs that's over a hundred dollars so 110 115 dollars plus i read that the shipping is very long so I'm not so sure if I'm willing to spend this much money on a little, you know, crossbody strap that I'm not even sure I will wear all the time. I initially wanted this as um, a belt bag, so I don't know. I really have to think about it. Well, compared to the price of this little piece, the price of the strap is very low, but at the same time, it's still super duper expensive in my opinion if it was 50 francs i would get it like immediately without even thinking about it but 100 francs plus the shipping it's a little bit much in my opinion for something that's not even hermes you know what i mean so we'll see about that i really have to think about it but love this piece do you own it how do you like it so far please let me know in the comments below because i'm so new to this little wallets from her mess this is actually the very first one in my collection so i really have zero expectations to be honest one thing about this piece also that i wanted to mention very quickly is that you can find it online sometimes mm, they just have a little bit of stock i recently saw one on the french website and it was in the caramel color i guess um very beautiful as well but i wasn't quite sure about it so i didn't go for it i didn't really want a super light color to begin with um and then yes this was available in store and i just purchased it in store and here is the other piece honestly this piece was a complete surprise I did not expect to find it because I went to Hermes multiple, multiple times asking for this piece and it was just never available and this time it was and <laughs> I was just so excited but we've got a slightly bigger box this time, um, a very seat actually already opened it, you know, to look at it one more time and then I wrapped it up again. Can you see? Wow! Here is another beautiful piece that I managed to score at Hermes. Here it is. It's the Constance to go. 
uh, it's like a wallet on a chain um, it's in palladium hardware it has this age and the color is so beautiful it's the color mauve this very pale light pink color which is absolutely gorgeous in my opinion but it's really really is pale it's like not pink pink but i would say more of a pale lilac color it's like a mixture of both i'm not sure if the camera is even showing its real color but it's absolutely stunning and then when we open it this is what it looks like inside. So it's really just a wallet on a chain. We have one compartment, a zip uh, compartment over here, the second compartment. Then we have all of these card slots over here, a lot of them, and another little pocket over here. And then there is one at the back as well, which is very convenient in my opinion to put a phone or some receipts something super slim and tiny and then in this pouch we have the crossbody strap and i was so afraid that the strap is very short because we went to zurich in summer we went to hermes and asked for it to go they came out with a new to go style i think it's shendang or something like that and it was completely different to this piece it was a lot shorter and it was the same the same uh, width, I believe, but it was a lot shorter. It didn't even fit my phone and then it just looked awkward. I don't know, I didn't like it at all and I rejected it. So this is exactly what I wanted. Well, originally I wanted a Kelly to go, but I don't mind the Constance to go, to be honest. Um, Kelly to go is definitely next on my wish list. Um, and here is the strap by the way and it's done in a very interesting way I haven't I haven't seen it before so everything is so new to me so we have this hole to attach uh, to the um, to go pouch and then we have this little you see attachment like metal attachment I'll show you anyway it's so difficult to explain it's kind of complicated to attach the strap especially since the bag is new and the leather is very stiff it's quite difficult i actually don't want to do it now so i'll just show you as an example i know i'm not gonna use it anytime soon because it's winter and in my opinion this is a very summery bag but so for example you attach it here right so we attach it here and then we have this little D-ring that connects two leather parts. So then when you close it, you see it's very flexible and it's easy to, you see, pull it up or down. And I love it. Like the attention to detail is so amazing. Yes, the price was super expensive, but it's a mess. And you can't do anything about it it's all about craftsmanship it's all about little details like this one it's just you know everything and i love it so much it is quite small super duper compact so if i put my phone inside nothing else fits so if i keep my phone in my hands i can uh, store my hand sanitizer lipstick you know airpods some cash luckily i don't need to carry my wallet with me when i wear um the to-go um wallet because it is a wallet obviously <laughs> it already has all the slots and compartments that uh, i will need um so that's a major plus but it does fit all the essentials and i think it's just a perfect mini bag to go on a walk to go to the restaurant you know if it's an evening occasion i can remove the strap completely and just use it as a clutch like this so you know also i can buy a separate strap and i can get it in cloth they sell the cloth straps it's like a thicker guitar strap kind of thing and to make it look more relaxed and more casual so the possibilities are endless and i actually once 
on the website so the to go um pochette like this one it was constance to go and it came with two straps already so it had the original like leather strap and it also came with the um, uh, cloth strap which i thought was so cool but the color was this dark burgundy color so i wasn't quite sure about it and by the time i was like oh whatever i'll just get it it was already sold so when you see a piece like this available online you just you just have to grab it anyway this is everything i wanted to share with you what do you guys think about this cute little pieces from our mess i truly think i was just so lucky and i'm so happy i managed to score everything i wanted so anyway thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one Bye.